Aaron, coach said that if the, the guys were put under hypnosis over the summer, and they were asked what game they were thinking about, that they would have said this one. Mm -hmm. Why do you think he said that? Just, uh, it's a big game. I mean, it's one that everybody's been looking forward to. Uh, it was a tough game, I feel like, last year. And uh, I know just from talking to everybody in the locker room, I know it's one that everybody's been looking forward to. So, I mean, it's going to be a lot of fun. It's going to be one where all the lights are on, millions are watching. And I know it's one I've been thinking about a lot. What did you learn from that loss? Really just you got to be ready. I mean, you can't come out there and just be down early. You got to play mistake free. I mean, we definitely made some mistakes in that game. I think we missed a field goal early. Uh, the pick that Todd threw. I mean, you just can't make mistakes really. What do you think the perception is of the team nationally in huge games? Our, perce our perception? No, the perception outside the program. Outside the program of us, um, that we can't win them. I mean, that's what, that's what I think people think right now. And uh, I know all of, everybody on the team wants to prove them wrong right now. I mean, that's just what I hear, what people tell me is they don't think we can win them. And we know we can, and hopefully we, we can get one this weekend. Aaron, is it uh, not very often you guys are a big underdog in your own stadium, but uh, six and a half, seven point underdogs? Does that fire you up when you hear that, or what's oh, your reaction? Definitely. Uh, we, I mean, to have a perfect year, we have to be perfect in the shoe. So uh, I know a lot of guys uh, feel very confident in the stadium, and uh, it just helps us out. And we are too. Yeah, you're right. We're not often underdogs in there, but uh, I know everybody's gonna be pumped up and just ready to go. Do you like the underdog role? I mean. Uh, personally, I, I like it. I like being the I like being the underdog, and uh, I just like just flying under the radar. So. Um, you dropped two spots in the AP from six to eight, and one in the coaches to seven. Not going the direction you want to go. Just your reaction to that. Um, I, I mean, it's early. I mean, it, it's early. It's the first game. Uh, get the jitters out. I mean, we knew Navy's going to be a good team. I mean, we knew we'd be in it for four quarters, and uh, I'm, I'm glad we prepared that way because uh, we definitely were. We knew they weren't going to stop fighting until the very end. So, I mean, I, I'll, I'm kind of happy we were in a close game because I think it can only benefit us. Some of your teammates talked Saturday in the offseason. You guys have talked about, hey, this, this stuff that nobody thinks we can win a big game, we've got to put an end to, this, to, to that. Talk about what you guys talked about and how that has been a focus. Oh, yeah, it's definitely been a focus. Uh, from when I've been here, I think we beat Texas my redshirt freshman year in Michigan. I think that, and well, Notre Dame my true freshman year. And that's, a, I think, our only like big wins where we weren't uh, actually supposed to win them or it was close. So uh, we've put a lot of time into talking about getting a big signature win for the year. and. Uh, Hopefully we can come out and get one. Is that a mental thing now? <laughs> when you lose any of those games in a row, does it become a mental thing? That um, I think it can, but uh, I, I personally don't think that it's affecting us uh, mentally right now. Um, I just know everybody is just ready to go. I mean, um, definitely just like with kicking, if you miss a few, or it can definitely <coughs> mess with you mentally. But that's right now. I, I don't think so. I think we're just ready to go and uh, ready to play this week.